My hands may be callous, pero la piel rota entre mis manos y cuando gira sobre mis hombros, los que cargaban a mi pequeñita, shoulders that pasted smiles on her face and dreams of flying like I once did, I dwell in possibility, lifting stones with concrete bones in the dead of the night, the first rays of dawn, the saguaros poking at the dry heat del viento en el desierto. But what exactly do we look like? A ship from 1492 caressing pure land, a mother floating in the water, one hand on a wooden board and an infant in the other. But what does it mean to be undocumented? For me, it means never sleeping in, having side jobs and staying double shifts, all these cereal crumbs, and we're always out of milk, all while having an exam on the same week. It means all the times we needed help, but my father didn't want it, insisting we're not criminals or victims, like those drug addicts. It means humiliation and risks of separation. It means not being worthy of a title as simple as being human. My name is Alexia Vasquez. I am undocumented, and this will be my second year at Pima paying out-of-state tuition. And I am also a slam poet. What that means is that I take my original writing, and it's usually prose or poetry that has some quality about it, something about it that doesn't want to stay on paper. So I perform it out loud to an audience in front of a microphone, sometimes on stage, and Usually audiences as big as this are bigger. And not only that, but I also teach students all around Tucson in high schools, and I hold workshops. And um, not only do I hold whole workshops, but I pretty much tell them that their words matter, that their words can make an impact in our community. And I want to continue to do so. And for that, I need an education, a higher education. And for now, I'm taking and pursuing a science degree as a short-term goal, which is not so short-term, since it's going to take four more semesters for me to even get an associate's degree. And that's where you come in and give me the opportunity so that I know that I'm not going to be in my late 30s still pursuing a short-term goal. <laughs> so this is all I have to say. Thank you. Uh, and are there any opposed to this particular thing? I am opposed. All right. So the motion passes. Uh,